all right so welcome back in this video i wanted to talk about connecting ex external drives uh, to your mac unfortunately the drive that i wanted to use does not have a usb-c connector i thought it had but when i opened the packet packing and go went through it it was basically usb3 and uh, uh, type a and no type c connector to it so i'm i'm unable to connect to it i really wanted to see the file system does it prompts me to change the file system or it goes and automatically detect the ntfs uh, from windows or not so that's a bummer but uh, i do know that if you connect the file uh, the like the icon to access that drive appears on the desktop and on your finder window as well but uh, for this video's sake i can show you where to enable or disable it for example you connect it it's not showing up ni neither on the desktop uh, and neither in the finder like it's not showing up here in here in the sidebar it should show up like that that's my hard drive it's right there and if it does not show your external drive does not show up here somewhere in locations then you can go to finder and preferences and you can under general you can see external disk so if it's um, basically uh, this journal is for the desktop so if it's unchecked that that external drive uh, icon will not appear here and on the sidebar again you can see that external hard disk external disk are supposed to be supposed to be appearing here but if for some reason it's been unchecked then it will not show up and for like I said if it's unchecked from both here and from the general even though you, it is connected it's being detected by the Mac it wouldn't won't show up either places and you will be say hey maybe it's uh, uh, the drive is bad but before you get to that conclusion make sure you come here in the finder preferences and check and make sure that uh, these are not unchecked all right so that is it for, oh one more thing if you have the uh, just like in windows when you're uh, unplugging the usb it's better to eject it make it checked even though some people i've seen they they don't care they just take it out and move on it works but it's always better to follow instructions and the instruction is always eject i do that all the time so in windows same thing if you double uh, if you right click it uh, on that external drive you will see an eject option use that or if it shows up over here on your icon you can uh, right click on that icon and click eject and then the f that window of that uh, uh, contents of that external drive it that will be closed like it will automatically close and that's when you know uh, that it is safe to unplug that uh, uh, external disk in windows you usually usually there is a uh, notification pop up on the right hand side by the clock saying it's safe to uh, remove the media so you get the picture all right so let's wrap this video here if this video has helped you i hope it <laughs> has other otherwise there was no uh, hands-on or nothing mm, like that uh please rate give and subscribe and share and if you did not like it send it to somebody <laughs> you don't like <laughs> just kidding all right thank you thank you for watching and you have a great day